What is up, everybody? Welcome back from a brand new video on the channel. This video is round 17. Round 17, can you believe it, guys? I oh, know we're past the halfway point of the season. Obviously, there's 27 rounds of the year, but yeah. Can you believe it? Yes, obviously, round 17. Obviously, we are going to go back to round 16 and see what we got wrong. So, yeah, but if you guys enjoy, make sure to like, subscribe to the channel. I'm doing so good, you know, trying to get to 2k subs. So, yeah. <clears throat> okay. So, round. Okay, so round 16. Not a. Well, it's a bad sub, but not a lot. Obviously, I did. Obviously, you know, Dolphin Storm. Unfortunately, I did win the Dolphins by four. But how the Storm won by six. 22% went for the Dolphins, 78% went for the Storm. So, yeah. Now, obviously, once again, another bad start. I took the Warriors by 10. They lost by 66. They lost. Titans won by 60, which Titans won by 66 to 6. Unbelievable. Yes. Yes, and, and then, you know, so yeah, I went. The Warriors by 10, they lost by 66, and then. The bo the roosters I went okay so it's the roosters and bulldogs I went to bulldogs by fourteen I thought the bulldogs could make it four in a row but once again a bad result yep bulldogs um I took bulldogs by fourteen the roosters won by eighteen and I took the seagulls by eight. They lost 14 points to nil. Yes. They lost by 14 points to nil. To the Seagulls. Well, they lost. They bet the Seagulls 14 points to nil. So, yeah. And I tipped them by 8. And now. Could you believe it? Uh, none of, so, basically, I haven't got none right. Unbelievable. I tipped the Canberra Raiders by 18. They the West Tigers beat the Canberra Raiders by 24. So, yeah. And 15% went for the West Tigers, 85% went for the Raiders. So, but now let's move on to round 17. Thank God, let's try to get some right. Okay, so to begin with Friday nights at Stradium, well, basically out of a a court, a court stadium Sydney it's just a stadium Australia Sydney but obviously it's a court stadium Bulldogs have not lost a home game this season incredible but you know the Bulldogs and the Sharks the Sharks have lost back to back games win loss so yeah you know the Bulldogs aren't doing that bad this season obviously this is probably one of the better seasons so yeah but you know it is the Bulldogs and the Sharks Obviously, the Bulldogs won three in a row, and then they lost to the um the Roosters, and obviously the Sharks won three in a row, lost two in a row, one um win one and lost. So yeah. Oh, now oh man, do I go with the Sharks? I'll be back the Sharks. Once the season against the Bulldogs, event two. But do I? You know, I'm gonna, I'm, I'm gonna go with the Bulldogs. I'm gonna go with Bulldogs win by eight. Yeah, Bulldogs win by eight. That sounds like a fair result. Yep, Bulldogs two probably win by eight. So yeah, and then it is the Warriors and the Broncos. Obviously, Broncos, I believe. Oh yeah. Broncos lost the last three in a row. The Warriors lost the last two in a row. Oh. Um. 
but you know obviously the Warriors do want a good result and they're in the home ground as well so the, obviously the Warriors would like it to get a good result back So yeah, so obviously, the Warriors, it's the Warriors having game obviously at Mount Summer Stadium, go Media Stadium, Auckland, but does a Broncos come off a three game losing streak have a win or does the Warriors after a two game losing streak win? Unfortunately, Sean Johnson is up for the next month, I, um, I just saw that, so... I believe Tamari Martin will go halfback, which is a good choice because he was that standing halfback against the Panthers, against the Dolphins and the Cowboys. So yeah, but oh, I'm gonna go with a Warriors win. I reckon a Warriors win by. By oh. I'm going to go for Warriors win by 16. Yep. Now the Newcastle Knights and the Palmer Eels. Okay. See, so, okay, so the Newcastle Knights is at McDonald's Jones Stadium, Newcastle. The Newcastle Knights lost the last three in a row. Yep. Newcastle Knights, Newcastle Knights lost three in a row. The Eels lost two in a row. So who would... Ooh. This could go either way. Yes, it could. It could go either way. But... Ooh, man. I'm, I'm actually... I'm actually going to go tip Newcastle here. I'm going to tip Newcastle, ooh, I'm going to tip Newcastle by 4. So yeah, I'm going to tip Newcastle by 4, I reckon Newcastle, Newcastle Knights can have a 4 point win over the Eels. Obviously, you know, it could go either way, I could even get this one wrong, but you know, I actually reckon, I'm, I actually reckon Newcastle could have a win. They almost beat my team, the Panthers, but could they beat the Eels? I reckon they can. Eels, back to back losses. Newcastle with three losses on top, but you know, I reckon Newcastle could get the win here. Now, the Storm and the Raiders, the Storm won three in a row, the Raiders lost two in a row. Man, obviously, Raiders lost, I believe it was 48 to 24 to the Tigers, obviously, yeah. But does See, the Raiders actually played good in Melbourne. Obviously, last time they, they did beat the Melbourne Storm was back in 2022 in their finals week one. But, yeah, I'm actually going to have a look at something here on my phone. Okay. Okay, so they all had to since nineteen ninety eight fifth played fifty three. The storm have won Yep, the Storm have won thirty seven against the Raiders. The Raiders have beat the Storm sixteen times, so yeah. And obviously preview matches obviously 13th of August 2023, the Storm beat the Raiders 48 points to 2. In 2022, 2022, the Raiders beat the Storm 28 points to 20. So, yeah. Wins this season, obviously, 79% for the Storm, 50% for the Raiders. So, yeah. But I'm going to tip the Storm here, obviously. By big margin, I'm going to tip the storm by 22. 
That way, Storm win by 22 points. Yep. Now, the Dragons and the Dolphins, obviously, the last time these two teams played, it was at KO Stadium. Dolphins won it 38 points to nil, so a big score. <coughs> so, yeah, that was a big score, obviously. 38 points to nil in the favour of the Dolphins, but Dragons, back to back. Well, Dragons came off a two game win streak, lost, they lost to the Man Seagulls, the Dolphins lost to the Storm. But, could I see a Dragons win? Yeah, I could, probably could, but do I see a Dolphins win? Absolutely. I could see a Dolphins win by. I'm going to say Dolphins win by 18. Yep. Oh, actually, no, actually, I could see this as a close one. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to tip the Dolphins by 12. Yep, Dolphins win by 12. Now, let's go, guys. My team, my Panthers taking on the Cowboys. Let's go, boys. Let's go. Yep, of the Panthers at Penrith Stadium, they only lost one home game this year, which was to the Dragons. But, you know, they beat the Cowboys 26 to 20 earlier this year. So, yeah. Obviously, you know, the way the, there's a way the Cowboys could win, but obviously I'm going to my boys, the Panthers. I'm going to the Panthers by 20. Yep, I reckon the Panthers win by 20 here. So, yeah. Now, the last one of the weekend is the Roosters and the West Tigers. Oh. <coughs> West Tigers obviously coming up back to back wins, so the Roosters. But I'm going to tip the Roosters though. By a 16 point win. So I'm tipping the Roosters by 16, okay. Okay, so I tip the Bulldogs, but okay, I'm going to do. <coughs> oh, the scores. Okay, Bulldogs and the Sharks. Anytime trust, <coughs> anytime trust score is Stephen Crichton. I got I got Stephen Crichton as anytime trust score for the Bulldogs, for the Warriors and the Broncos. I believe he is back. Dallin White is in Lesniak. I got him as anytime trust score for the Warriors. If he isn't, if he's not back, I do have. I do have Roger Chovashek as anytime trust score. But obviously. That one is the anytime try score I got. But if he is not back in this one, I do have Roger Tulvashek, so yeah. And for the Knights. Okay, you know what? I'm actually going to have the Eels score first. Yep, my anytime try score for the Eels actually. Obviously, I did Newcastle by four, but my anytime try score is Mitchell Moses as my anytime try score, so yeah. And for the Storm and the Raiders, obviously got to go with him. My time try score for I mean, my time try score for the Storm. I have to go with Xavier Coates to score any time try score. So yeah, so any time try score is Xavier Coates. So yeah. And for the Dragons and the Dolphins, my my any time try score, I'm gonna have to go with. Jemaina Sako to score the first try. <coughs> so yeah. Panthers and the Cowboys. My only time try score for the Panthers. I <coughs> I got probably I'm gonna say Isaac Tago to score. The first try for the Panthers. And the Roosters and the West Tigers. Yep. And my new time try score I got for the Roosters. You know, I'm actually going to do a West Tiger. I'm going to say the West Tiger score first. And my new time try score, I'm going to say Aiden Caesar. Yep, I'm going to say Aiden Caesar scores the first try for the West Tigers. 
So, but that is my time trial scores obviously, and that is my tips. So, let me see. So, I've tipped the Bulldogs by 8. I tipped the Warriors by 16. I tipped the Knights by 4. I tipped the Storm by 22. I tipped the Dolphins by 12. I tipped, I, I tipped the Panthers by 20. I tipped the Roosters by 16. Yes. But yeah, if you guys enjoyed the video, make sure to leave a like, subscribe to the channel, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.